The stakes are high as the North Island Silver Tips of the BC Major Midget League gun for the sixth and final playoff spot. Be hard to have the season end so early. Jordan Levesque and Garrett Dunlop score as the Silver Tips edge the Fraser Valley Bruins 2-1 to salvage the split as the Bruins top the Tips 5-1 the night before. It was an inspiring effort. So I was feeling the puck well. The boys were letting me see pretty much every shot and uh, they didn't have me give me too many rebounds to deal with, so it was good. Everyone was hitting, everyone was getting the puck deep. Lots of sh uh, We had way more shots today than yesterday. Although it's a win today for the Nanaimo Bay squad, it hasn't always been smooth sailing. The Silver Tips had an early season slide where they lost six of seven games. Get back to what we do best. Finish we had the least hands. amount of kids try out in uh, the entire league. Uh, I believe it was 37 skaters total, um, as compared to a lot of teams that had uh, around 100. Let's go. There may not have been a large pool of players to choose from at training camp, but they've established a gritty, hard-working identity. Shoot. Forward Chase Lang has paced the Silver Tips offense all season long. He's approaching the 60-point mark, putting him amongst the leaders in the BC Major Midget League. The fifth-round draft pick of the Calgary Hitmen in last spring's Bantam draft says even his great season so far is even a bit of a surprise to him. I didn't expect to be this high in the stats. I was just hoping to be one of the, on the top line of the team and really push for some ice time, and it's been a great year. I've got power play, penalty kill, and I'm leading the province for 96s. The Silver Tips have improved considerably this BC Major Midget League season and have put themselves in a position to make the playoffs and they can go a long way in doing that with two wins next weekend against the visiting Okanagan Rockets to conclude their regular season. In Nanaimo, for Shaw TV, I'm Ian Holmes.